Hey guys, welcome back to Hendrickson Family Farm. Today, me and Ava, and well, Landon's still asleep. Yesterday we went uh, fishing, and they went crab fishing yesterday evening. We're also going crab fishing this evening. I did lose my GoPro in the ocean. About 12 miles out, out uh, I dropped it in the water. It kind of sucks. Uh, Ava has been swimming right there all since we got here. Yeah. Pretty much. We're just, our, our, where we're staying at is um, a block from the ocean. So it's, we're, it's just a walk down here. Oh, it's probably because there's bait fish moving around. Yes, so yesterday morning we went to go fishing. We had to stop and get um, bait. We had to catch some um, sandies to, uh, for chum uh, and for bait for the sharks. Uh, we did, uh, every time you would throw or you would hook one of the, the sandies, you had to reel it in super fast because the dolphin would come pull it off the line and then it literally come up right by the edge of the boat. You could almost touch the dolphins. Well, you probably could have if you wanted to, but the, the guide said do not touch the dolphins because they are not friendly because my brother-in-law and my father-in-law did ask if they could touch the dolphins. Uh, we're actually up looking at uh, going, fixing to go to a um, gift shop for Emma a, a shirt or something, and I need a hat. I left my hat sitting at the house when we left. So we got Emma a shirt and a bracelet to take back with us. Is that right, Ava? Yep. Now the sun's out. Well, we're behind the building. Like I said, we only, we're only like a, a block from the, the beach, but there's a, um, a gift shop right up to right up, right on the corner where we have to walk up at. So it's kind of nice. Um, but that's going to be it for right now. When we go to the beach later, I'm going to take the big camera. Uh, as long as I don't lose the big camera again, because, like I said, I, I already lost the GoPro. I didn't know you lost the GoPro. Yeah, it's, it's in the ocean. Oh uh, so, um, well, that's going to be it for now. Well, uh, actually, when we get back over here, I'll show you the house that we're staying in. Uh, we've, had, we've had a little bit of an issue with the house that we're staying in. Uh, apparently my brother-in-law didn't go fishing with us last night uh, he stayed or yesterday he stayed and the cops showed up had a gun pulled on him because apparently the between the people managing it and the people that own it didn't realize that there, we were going to be here little yesterday and they didn't so then they the cops got called somehow they pulled the gun on Dustin. All the girls and everybody were already at the beach. Uh, so, you guys didn't see it, did you? No, we, we um, just, Dustin te texted us. Yeah, so, luckily we got it all situated. We didn't know anything about it. We were out on, me, Landon, and my nephew, and my father-in-law, we were all out on the, uh, the boat fishing, so. But, um, that's... That's it. Well, we're almost back to the house now, so I can show you guys. I'm sure people are looking out, watching me talk to a camera, wondering what the hell's going on. <laughs> but uh, it's the the blue house right there. That's where we're staying at. That's my mother-in-law sitting on the front porch right now. When we get over there, we'll the camera in her face and see see if she likes it or not it's getting hot it is getting hot yeah but that that ambulance it was right there this morning the guy was just freaking passed out hmm. I know it was it was it was kind of crazy 
but we, this is a one-way street that we're walking on and the ambulance came up it backwards oh right here so that's the house right there that we're staying in and if you look real closely my father-in-law's up there and my mother-in-law's hiding behind the deal <laughs> with the yeah <laughs> Here's Jeff, he's flying a kite. He's trying to get it pretty far up there. Huh? Is it still going? Yeah. Pistol's firing. Huh. Boomer sooner. It's going down, Jeff. Oh, look, Landon's flying a kite. Landon, you having fun in Galveston? Yeah. You think Mom should have came with us? Yeah. Mom and Emma. Yeah. How high up is the kite? Oh, it's way up there now. Hey, look who finally showed up. There's Blake. Hey, uh, where have you guys been all day? Huh? Where have you guys been all day? I don't know. Everywhere. Don't drop that, you'd be two for two. Ah, funny guy. <laughs> so, they're giving me a hard time because I dropped a GoPro in, the, in it already once. But we're going to go ahead and take it down and set it set, set the camera down let's get railing real quick is that a GoPro? no this isn't my gopro my gopro's out out there about 15 miles oh you lost it yeah i dropped it in the water So we went swimming and now we are up here fishing. It's about done for the evening, but we went out on the pier here. You can't really see it because of the light. If I get the light out of the way, maybe you can. Out on the pier and then they're crab, catching blue crab out this way. Blake's out there with uh, Ed. And then Landon is all the way out here on the pier. We'll go out here and see what he's doing. And see what Landon's doing real fast. But so this is what they're doing with the, the crab fishing. They're putting chicken on the string and then they pull the, the crab in and then they get the net and come up, out behind the back of it. And that's how they catch the crab. All right, let's go. You guys want to go see what? That was her. That wasn't me. What are you doing? And Dustin's over here. I don't know. Have you caught anything, Dustin? Uh, I've caught a ton of them, but they let go as soon as you start pulling. Oh, yeah? Yeah. But they uh, they don't like chicken that much. <laughs> Are they just in the rocks? Yeah, they'll like, they'll pull the chicken down into all the holes, and then as soon as you try and pull them out, they just let go. Oh, I see. I haven't done any crab fishing. I was just out here fishing with... Ugh. I was just out here fishing with uh, on the pier with Landon. The pier is pretty far, pretty long out here. We'll we'll go out here and check on Landon real fast, and then I think we're gonna go. Ava, what what are you going to do? I'm getting my nose pierced right there. So we're going to do that as soon as we're done here. So she's getting a little impatient. Do you have any bites? Nothing. The other the other bait that we were using, it had like a little hole notched into it. Oh, like from where you bit, where something bit it? Yeah. Oh, I see. Otherwise Maybe not. a crab or something? Couldn't tell you. 
All right, well, I was just walking out here. Well, oh, hang on. Um, yeah, me too. So, so Landon didn't have any luck, but yeah, so we're like this far off the pier here. Um, we're pretty far back here. It's probably 150, 200 yards that way to the uh, to the land. We are. It's by Jamaica Beach in uh, Galveston. That's the closest thing that I can think of to, to say where we're at. Uh, but yeah, there's a bunch of people fishing out here. Uh, my father-in-law, he's got some relatives that live down in this area. That's how, how we got to come over here and uh, yeah that's just you guys having any luck out there I got a hold of two of them one bit me and ran off and the other one he's just too fast for being caught Just when you're pawing around under here, mm -hmm. don't put your hand anywhere you can't see it. Because like I was telling you, those big stone crabs, they can have claws the size of my hand. And they will take your finger. Mm -hmm. So, always make sure you know what you're sticking your hand around, you know? Right. This is going to be the end of the video. So, if you haven't subscribed, thanks for at least sticking around this far. And we would appreciate it if you subscribed. And we'll catch you on the next one.